Noble, Oklahoma. Noble is a city in Cleveland County, Oklahoma, United States, and is part of the Oklahoma City metropolitan area. The population was 6,481 at the 2010 census. Noble is Cleveland County's third largest city behind Norman and Moore. On April 22, 1889, the day the first Oklahoma land run opened the unassigned lands in the middle of Indian Territory to settlers, J.W. Klinkelsmith, Albert Rennie and several other businessmen forded the South Canadian River and laid claim to the town site that was to become Noble. The town was named in honor of Secretary of the Interior John Noble, who was instrumental in opening the unassigned lands to settlement. The group had great plans for Noble, hoping it would become the future county seat. The Santa Fe Railroad completed a railroad depot in Noble in August 1889. For several years, Noble was a major shipping point for cattle and other goods from both sides of the Canadian River. Business prospered even more when Charles Edwin Gurry built a new suspension toll bridge across the Canadian River in 1898. The suspension bridge washed out in 1904 and other communities began developing nearby. The last passenger train stopped in Noble in 1944 and the depot was moved. Noble considers itself to be the Rose Rock capital of the world, as the concentration of barium sulfate in the soil is believed to be higher there than anywhere else, causing the formation of Rose Rocks. Similar formations are found throughout Cleveland County and the Wichita and Washita Mountains. Noble sets aside the first Saturday each May to celebrate its annual Rose Rock Festival. Local geologist Joe Stein and his wife opened the Timberlake Rose Rock Museum in 1986. Noble is located along the southwest edge of Cleveland County at 35.141173. It is bordered to the north by Norman, to the east by Slaughterville, and to the west by the Canadian River, across which is McLean County. U.S. Route 77 passes through Noble, leading north to the center of Oklahoma City and south to Purcell. According to the United States Census Bureau, Noble has a total area of, of which is land and, or 1.72 percent, is water. As of the census of 2010, there were 6,480 people. 1,956 households, and 1,486 families residing in the city. The population density was 420.1 people per square mile, 162.2 per square kilometer. There were 2,134 housing units at an average density of 170.4 per square mile, 65.8 per square kilometer. The racial makeup of the city was 90.30% white. 0.19% African American, 4.87% Native American, 0.25% Asian, 0.02% Pacific Islander, 0.38% from other races, and 3.99% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 2.74% of the population. There were 1,956 households out of which 40.0% had children under the age of 18 living with him. 58.5% were married couples living together, 13.3% had a female householder with no husband present, and 24.0% were non-families. 21.0% of all households were made up of individuals and 7.9% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.63 and the average family size was 3.03. In the city, the population was spread out with 28.6% under the age of 18, 8.2% from 18 to 24, 31.5% from 25 to 44, 20.8% from 45 to 64, and 11.0% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 34 years. For every 100 females, there were 92.3 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 85.9 males. The median income for a household in the city was $35,250, and the median income for a family was $40,533. Males had a median income of $30,417 versus $23,690 for females. The per capita income for the city was $16,732. About 4.5% of families and 6.5% of the population were below the poverty line including 5.5% of those under age 18 and 10.8% of those age 65 or over. Gary Hayes was elected mayor in March 2006. The Noble Public Schools District, Independent Number 40 is numbered by the state, 
covers a huge area, stretching west to east across south-central Cleveland County between Norman and Little Axe school districts to the north and Lexington's to the south. Currently the district has three elementary schools, one middle school, and one high school. The elementary school for children in kindergarten through first grade is the Catherine I. Daly Elementary School, named after the longtime principal. The current principal of KID, as it is commonly called, is Mike Pryor. The next school in the Noble Public School System is the John Hubbard Elementary School, named for the longtime district superintendent from the 1950s 70s, and educates children in second and third grade. Nathan Gray is the principal. Following their two years at Hubbard, Children attend the Pioneer Intermediate School for 4th and 5th grades. Pioneer formerly educated 6th graders, however, they now attend the recently completed Noble Middle School. Karen Canfield is the principal and is serving in her 23rd year in this position. Until recently, children went to Noble Junior High for 7th through 8th grade. However, the building that used to be the Junior High is now Noble Public Schools Administration Building. Noble Middle School was built and educates students in 6th through 8th grade. When the superintendent, Curtis Inga, died they renamed the school the Curtis Inga Middle School. The principal is Ronnie Fuchs, former Noble graduate and assistant principals are Becky McLaughlin and Liz Benson. Noble High School, with the Bears as its mascot, is where children finish their secondary education in Noble. The school's athletic programs compete in Oklahoma's Class 5A in most sports, including football, basketball, and baseball. The wrestling team competes in Class 4A. Frank Solomon is the head principal while Steve Barrett and Mike Barefoot serve as assistant principals. Noble High is also home to many clubs, programs and extracurricular activities, such as a Class 4A marching band under the direction of Fred Queen. Over the decades since the district and high school grew to their modern size in the 1970s, various programs and newspaper, yearbook, vocal music, student council, FFA and others have held statewide office and been leaders in their fields. The Noble Public Schools Foundation Board for Academic Excellence has initiated a 50 for 50 campaign to raise $50,000 a year for endowment to benefit Noble students by funding teacher grants. As of June 2015 they have raised over $165,000. The Noble Public Schools District is far larger in area than the boundary limits of the city of Noble proper, owing to the closure and consolidation of all the original small dependent schools in the 1940s-60s. This means that students come from the north half of Slaughterville as well as Noble and unincorporated areas, and even a strip of rural South Norman. Formally dating to only 1970, the town of Slaughterville never carved out its own school district, and its residents' children attend either Noble, Lexington, or are homeschooled. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.